Today I'm going to show you the fastest way to get out of mobile substrate on your iPod Touch or your iPhone, iPhone 3GS, whatever. Of course your iPod has to be jailbroken to go into mobile substrate. So first of all, um, let's say you downloaded Winterboard or Telescreen or you put on too many themes on your iPod and then you went into safe mode. I'm not going to do any of stuff like that so I'm just going to go into SB settings and put it on safe mode on purpose. In case you guys didn't know, safe mode is also known as mobile substrate or sad iPhone. It'll show that whenever you get the safe mode and then it'll slide to unlock and then we'll say we apologize for the inconvenience but springboard has just crashed mobile substrate did not cause this problem it has protected you from it your device is now running in safe mode all extensions that support this safety system are disabled reboot or restart springboard to return to the normal mode, to return to this dialog, touch the status bar. Okay, so you're in safe mode. As you can see, the background is gray. Your five icon dock, I mean, your five rows doesn't work. It's really stupid. So, you don't know what to do when you do this, when that happens to you. So, go over, find Cydia, click on it. You just gotta let it load the data here, so I'll come back once it's done that. Okay, so, um, so you're in safe mode. You gotta go. Um, you're in safe mode, and then you go into Cydia. Yeah? Go to packages. Oh wait, no. Manage packages. All the way down. Some things that cause this are Winterbore, if you have put too many themes on, or Telescreen. Um, this always happens to me when I use Doc Prefs. So let's say it was Doc Prefs that messed me up. There. Doc. It's the Doc screen. So all you gotta do is go up in the right hand corner, press. Oh my god, Cydia! Retarded piece of crap! Okay. Go to D. There's Doc. Oh my god, Cydia! Yeah, just reload the data and I'm trying to film a video. That's just great, yeah. There's one of the downsides of jailbreaking your iPod. Cydia's retarded. Come on! Okay, so there's Doc, and it tells you all the stuff about it. Go up in the right hand corner, press modify, and then press remove. Fucking iPod! Not working for me today. Hey, hey, iPod, idiot, fuck, okay, modify, then remove, it's gonna like take 20 minutes for it to do the thing, and then press confirm, but uh, don't do it if it's not giving any problems, so, yeah, just press confirm if you want to delete it, I'm not gonna do that because, uh, oh my, f okay, I'm not gonna do that because I like, Dock settings, so I will, yeah, I'll come back when it's done reloading the data again. Okay, so once you're done that, just go back to the home page. I went into safe mode on purpose. Or if you have SB settings and then you went into safe mode, it'll say at the top of the screen, exit safe mode. My camera sucks, so you can't really see it. Um, slide across. It'll pop up with this again, where it says we apologize for the inconvenience. Press restart. If you try to restart without moving the thing that made you go into safe mode on purpose, just, uh... Um... 
I mean, if you... Oh, I'm tired. Press restart, and... If you don't remove that thing that made you go into safe mode on purpose, it, and you press restart, it'll just go back to the sad iPhone screen, it'll go right back into mobile substrate. Slide to unlock. Back to normal. There's my five things in a row. Alright, I'll let you hack zero. Sorry for the bad video quality. I just get really pissed off at my iPod.